Hi everyone, it's Connie from This Old Dress. Today I'm going to talk about things that I've been loving in December. My first fashion favorite are these jeans from Topshop. They are the Jamie jeans. I talked about them in my Hong Kong haul, so if you want to watch that, I'll link it below. They are these blue skinny jeans with knee rips. They're high-waisted. Uh, they are super stretchy, so they fit your butt real good. Like, they hug right in the right spot. Yeah, so they fit amazing. And what I like about these and Topshop jeans is that they come in a petite size. So that means the length of these jeans are uh, 28, which fit my legs perfectly. Um, so I don't have to fold them up or hem them or anything. So I've been loving those. So my second fashion favorite is this purse that I got from a store called Charles and Keith. And it looks like this. Uh, I had never purchased anything from this place before. I actually never heard of it. But when I went in the store, I ended up loving this. It has a great shape. It's really sturdy and it holds a lot of things and it goes with everything I wear. So moving on to beauty favorites. The first thing I've been loving is this blush by MAC. It's called Pink Tea. It's just this really beautiful light pink color that's really natural. It's not too dark or not too light, so I've been wearing this a lot in December. My next beauty favorite is also by MAC. It's this lipstick called Rebel. I'm sure you've seen it before or heard of it from other YouTube gurus. I'm not a guru, but other people are. It's this plummy color, and I'm wearing it right now, and I really love it. It just makes your lips pop, and it adds a little extra something to your outfit. So I've been wearing this a lot in December. I've also really been loving Bumble and Bumble hair products. So two things that I, or two products that I've been using a lot in December is this BB Texture Undressing Cream. It's kind of like, I don't know how to describe it, it's kind of like a jelly texture and you kind of rub it in your hands when your hair is dry or a little bit damp and you just kind of scrunch it and it gives it that kind of messy, undone, second day hair kind of feel. I use that in conjunction with the Surf Spray. So I use that and then I spritz this a little bit after and then again mess it up a bit and then it just gives my hair so much texture because normally it's just super straight and I don't really like that. Okay, moving on to scents or things that smell good that I've been loving this December. The first thing is this fragrance called Vanilla Coco by, by Sud. Sassy Perry. I do not know if I'm saying that correct, but I got this from Sephora and basically this line um, has a bunch of vanilla scents and they mix it with different things. So this one is vanilla and cocoa, there's like vanilla and grapefruit, vanilla lemon, whatever. But this one smells so good. It smells like marshmallows or cupcakes or cookies, you know, like delicious baking. I don't know. But I'm really loving this a lot. It makes me smell super yummy. And what I like about it, it after a while, it kind of sets in and it starts smelling more and more sweet. Some people might not like that, but I really like it. And it actually kind of smells like Lucky Charms marshmallows. You can't go wrong with that. Who doesn't want to smell like Lucky Charms? Mm. Um, I've also been loving this candle from Bath & Body Works. It's called Harvest Gathering. It's in this really pretty container. As you can see, I've burned a lot of it already. But this just smells like smells like apple cider, like fresh apple cider boiling in your pot. And it makes a whole house smell amazing. And it was really nice for December, making my apartment feel really cozy. So an album I've been really loving last month is called Still Life by Don Golden. It's a side project. I don't know if you've heard of the band called Houses, but it's their side project, and this album is amazing. It's a little bit like ambient, it's acoustic, but it's also a little bit electronic. All the songs are really relaxing, and they have a really good beat, so I've been listening to it nonstop. So I'll link it down below so you can check it out there. So for TV favorites, last month I basically binge watched the entire season of MasterChef Junior. Oh my god, it's such a good show, you guys. Like, these kids are like 8 years old, 9 years old, and they're cooking these amazing dishes. And I'm thinking, like, when I was 8 years old, what was I, what was I doing when I was 8, falling off my bike? I don't really know. Not cooking amazing meals, that's what. <laughs> but it's such a good show, and I have a huge love crush on Gordon Ramsay. And he's super nice to the kids in this show, and they're all so encouraging to each other. And they're just, like, really trying hard to reach their dreams of cooking. And sometimes I get really emotional watching it. Like, there are a few times where I have shed a few tears. I cannot lie. <laughs> but you should definitely watch it. It's 
you can watch the whole thing on YouTube. So just search Master Chef Junior Season 2. One is also amazing, so check it out for sure. So those were my December favorites. Comment below and let me know the things that you've been loving this December, and I'd love to check it out. Um, as always, rate, comment, and subscribe if you like what you see and you want more videos. I will do that for you. All right, talk to you later. Bye!